Hey Capricorns, let's see what's going on in your love life right now. Oh, what the messages are for Capricorn. If you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe. To my beautiful, loyal subscribers, thank you for being with me. It's my three-year anniversary um, from starting YouTube. So thank you for being here. If you've been here from the beginning, we've been through a lot. <laughs> Let's see, trust, okay, this situation, Capricorns, is calling for you to have faith, right? Um, it's often blind faith in spirituality, so it can be difficult. So sometimes we do need a reminder, like, just trust the process here. Calling in your soulmate, your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations are actually helping to bring somebody towards you, to bring you two together. Um, let's see, free yourself, okay, it's time to take back control of your life i guess we've all been feeling what's been going through my mind all day is prison planet i kind of feel like we are all imprisoned at the moment um so i feel like you could be getting a little bit tired of being locked up um get out in nature right your earth signs go and ground yourself um i know you guys are hard workers so you're wanting to be do that but you know it, get out there and enjoy some nature as well just to sort of re-energize yourself let's see ace of autumn look at that autumn get out there in nature ace of pentacles a windfall of money advice or assistance from others a very successful project a happy change in your career so trust that this big change is coming and this big windfall of money is here soon and it could be what you're calling in with your affirmations and prayers right this uh, huge windfall of money um, sorry I hate doing um, the videos uh, where I'm facing the videos because I'm constantly looking at the cards to read messages and I'm just ignoring you guys I don't mean to, I just wanted um, to sit downstairs in my living room. I'm getting on a bit, you know. Um, grandma needs her back supported. <laughs> Three of springs, okay. Plan your next steps with the eye on the long term. Have patience. There are more good things to come. Satisfaction from a job well done. Um, this will be something creative. Um, if we look at anything short term, it can look like, oh, it's going a bit awry. Oh, it's going a bit chaotic, but look at it from the long term. Three of Wands here. Good news is coming in. Your ships are coming in. Um, there's some sort of communication coming in. For some of you, it will be a committed relationship offer. And others of you, oh, as I say that, I turn the lovers over in my hand. But others of you are maybe freeing yourself from relationships to focus on career a little bit, okay? True love that finds long-lasting that is a long lasting, sorry. <laughs> um, choices made from the heart and a return to good health, Capricorn. So, yeah, I guess a lot of us have been worried about health issues. So we do um, want to go back to basics, right? And um, buy those good things that are good for you here. Soul food, right? Healthy food. Um, so, yeah, you could be doing something like that. As I do that, the seven of wands is jumping out. Um, so this is a challenges. Um, so it might have been that your career or love life has faced these challenges, but it's telling you, look, don't give up here. Be assertive. You've got to keep pushing, even when it seems like the odds are against you here. Um, when we see the lovers, three of wands, ace of pentacles, we know that this um, amazing stuff is coming to you in a very short period of time as well okay um, the six with the lovers is um, about your service to humanity so I'm not surprised that Korea is coming up as well but it's saying look you guys are in it for the long haul um, you know how to work hard um, through adversity so don't give up here now okay um, what's flipping over in my hand the Prince and Princess of Pentacles. So you could be dealing with an earth sign or an earth sign could be coming towards you here. Again, this can indicate you're focused on your career and could be learning something new, taking the learning to the next step, um, maybe working for yourself. Maybe you did a certain thing for other people and now you're doing it for yourself. Um, why build other people's dreams, right? I keep getting lots of offers 
um, from different um, channels to work with them and um, big companies. And I guess it would look amazing to have those under my belt, right? But why am I going to build somebody else's dream and be involved in some sort of big company when um, I can do this for myself and trust that the message I'm sending out there is getting out there. And you can trust here that you're building your own dreams. It might take learning new things, but that's life, right? We learn every day. Um, so I see some pentacles being offered to you here. Um, the ace of pentacles, somebody might offer you more money to stay in that certain job if you um, threaten to leave or something here. Um, so it could be that a love offer that you've waited a long time for is coming towards you now. Um, it's small steps with the Princess of Pentacles. So it's like, um, hi, how are you? Like small communication, slow communication even. But I think you're a little bit cautious yourself about getting into this romance, okay? Because we do have that free yourself card. Um, and that's seven of wands. So you might be a little bit suspicious of people <laughs> um, and being cautious. Just don't be overly cautious, right? And don't overwork. Okay, got what did I see there? Don't overwork, okay? Because we have to have this happy balance of um, work life, family life, relaxing time, re-energizing time and time for love, right? Let's see. Nine of cups. It's your time for love. It's time for that ninth cup to turn to return to you here. Um, maybe in a long journey. That's the Knight of Pentacles, um, Prince of Pentacles in this deck. It could have been a long journey. So it could be that um, you're of a certain age and you may feel like, well, love has passed me by. Um, and then you're quite surprised to be finding that um, actually a great love is coming into your life at this time. Um with a very serious offer. Um, yeah, it's going to be a wake up call because it's you're not expecting it. Um, a wake up call of the good kind. Um, that's good for usually in tarot channels in general readings. The wake ups are not usually so nice. Um, so Capricorn, I like this wake up call for you. Um, it's saying, hey, you still got it. Don't worry. It's coming. Here I am with that ninth cup. Um, and you learn to love from a different perspective and you learn new things, but in a much lighter energy. Um, so that's really good. Just don't give up on love here. You've got to trust the process. Um, Ace of Pentacles again. Funny thing is, um, when I've been doing these readings, each sign has had a double card come out. And for you, the double card is the Ace of Pentacles. So, um, play the lottery. <laughs> uh, no, um, there is a huge sum of money um, that's coming your way. It might be owed to you. It might be that there's a court case or something going on here, but this is huge money coming your way, Capricorns. Go ahead and um, wait till you've got it and then splash out. Remember me? Because I told you this money's coming. Um, but you can see this huge amount of money coming your way. It helps you to live different along with this love. It could even be like an inheritance or something like that. Um, because it is such a huge amount of money um, coming in a lump sum. Uh, that's why I say inheritance. It's usually the Ten of Pentacles that can indicate inheritance as well, guys. So, um Princess of Wands here, Page of Wands in the normal deck. This is starting up your own business, um, starting and starting off as you mean to go on. Really excited about it, um, not dragging your feet like with the Prince of Pentacles there. Um, you know, really talkative about it, excited about it. So this could be you advertising as well, your business or, you know, your new job and things like that. Um, but it's starting something new with the Princess of Pentacles there. Very exciting. It could be that you are dealing with somebody younger than you uh, with an age difference with the, uh, what they call the pages, <laughs> the different names in each deck. I'm getting too old. Um, the world card. The world is your oyster here. There is these beautiful new beginnings with endless possibilities with the world here. There's a huge shift coming, especially in your financial uh, front here. There is a huge shift coming and you're going to be happy with this. Two of swords. Don't let this hold you back, guys. Decision is... Um, maybe your head and your heart arguing a little bit too much. So go with your heart, right, guys? 
and allow these beautiful things to unfold for you. Good luck, guys.